What's up guys, it's Unders, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make this 808 slide these bass in just a couple of clicks using the quick sampler. For this is already inside Logic. So I'm just gonna show you how to use the quick sampler and how I made this bass in just a couple of clicks. What we'll do, we'll just make a completely new channel. So I'm just gonna copy this with Command D and we'll get rid of that one there. So we need to load up the quick sampler and we just used a sample for this that is available in the Logic libraries. To bring up the Logic loop library, we can simply tap O on the keyboard and that's going to bring that up for us. Go straight into the search, just type 808. And what we used here was dubstep 808 synth bass number two, this one. We're going to drag that and drop it into optimized in the quick sampler. And we just used the first little part of this sample. So in quick sampler, we've got a bunch of handles over here. The first one we're going to drag right over to here like this. So we're just working with this little chunk here. If we hold option and use our mouse, we can zoom in. So to get rid of the clicky bit at the start, we just use the handle over here. And we drag this to the zero crossing around about here. And when I say zero crossing, we're looking for this yellow line here. We want it to cross exactly with the line in the middle. That's going to help us avoid some clicks and pops. We want it to start around about there. And similarly, we want it to finish on the zero crossing as well. This would just pop every single time. So we're just going to bring that to a zero crossing here. And for the loop, we've got these yellow handles here. We don't want it to loop the start again. We want it to kind of maintain the same sound. So we're going to bring the loop points in like this. And we want those to be on zero crossings as well. That one should be at the end. Beautiful. And we want the zero crossings on the loop to be opposite. So this one goes down. And this one is just going into that. So it should loop really, really well there. So let's just bring our MIDI over. So far, that gives us this. And we could tweak the loop up a little bit. So maybe try looping it here instead. That works a little bit nicer. Now we want to switch the polyphony over here in amp from 16 to mono. So it's going to perform like a mono bass, meaning if two notes ever overlap each other, they'll cut each other off, but not quite because we're going to make them slide from one into the other. In the pitch section, we're going to just turn the glide up and we can just do that to taste. On this patch, we did it to about 215, something like that. So that now gives us this. Now it really pops and clicks when it starts. So we're going to add a little bit of control with the filter. So we switch the filter on just here. We push the drive up nicely as well. And we want a little bit of control with that cutoff. We're actually going to bring it down so it starts and sounds like this. And then opens up. So the way we do that, we need to go over to the mod matrix here. I'm going to turn this velocity one so that it is the ADSR for the filter. We're going to choose filter envelope just there. Then we want its target to be the filter cutoff and we want it to be 100% like that. And then this ADSR down here now controls that. At the moment, it's instantly snapping up and turning back off. So we're getting that poppy click again. I'm going to just drag this a touch forward. So now it gradually opens up, but we want it to stay open once it's opened up. So we could bring it back even further. And on the longer note, our loop is still kind of clicking. So we're going to zoom right in, make sure we've got that as close as possible being on the zero crossing. I think it might be that little bit just there. That's a little bit better. And from there, you've pretty much got your bass. You can tweak it to your heart's desired. I just added some very simple loops in and we've got this. Hope that video was helpful for you guys. If you want to see more on the quick sampler, leave a comment below and I will make more videos around the quick sampler. If you've got a specific request, let me know in the comments and I will see you guys on the next video. Keep
it real I'm independent, I don't need no deal I'm Jaws on the beat, I got flow that kills Do my thing with a few G's, Lauren Hill